right. All right, driver's side is going to drop down, I think, but you're you're going to be high on your right. You're good. Uh, yeah, you're straight. Keep coming. Hi there. Welcome to the Beaten Trail. We'd like to first thank our sponsors and partners for being on board and supporting us. We do appreciate it. And now for our continuation of day two, part two, for our exciting conclusion of our adventures out in Royal Blue. Previously. Shane gives Adrian some advice, and Adrian heads up to tackle the rocks and the hill the best he can in his high lifter. Adrian's camera gives a unique perspective of just how steep and how rough this trail is. saving grace is that the trail is dry and the rocks are not covered in ice at this point. offers a little bit of balance just to make sure that Adrian doesn't flip over onto his side. Slow off the brake a little. Just right. offers a little bit of guidance to get him back down keep flat going. so he can make it up to the next step. Do I keep backing up? Stop for a second. see how rough the trail is and now we can see what Josh has to go through to get up to the next set of muddy troughs and ruts. Josh's axles do break, although you can probably pinpoint the exact sound if you're in his vehicle. From here we don't know the exact time that it did break, but it's around this time when he was trying to get up this rut. It was pretty clear that no matter what machine you had, or what tires you had at this point, it was not going to be easy or possible to even get up this muddy mess. Later on, you'll see how deep the ruts are. Josh here has 35 inch tires, so you can get a good idea how deep it is. Shane backs down the hill slowly and decides to come around and see what he can do from the top and find the rest of the group. As he does, he comes around the bend at the bottom of the trail and finds a surprise.
thankfully there's a group down there to assist with bringing the vehicle back up. So putting the drone up gave us a unique opportunity to see over the hill and down into the trails where Josh and Adrian were stuck. Giving a bird's eye view and also pairing the radio audio in gave us a unique perspective of what was going on in real time and we wanted to share that with you, so do enjoy. The drone is directly above you if you want to give a play-by-play -play or anything that you're trying. We're watching and recording. Thank you, big brother.
Were you up on this already? I couldn't get it. No, that's where he broke. Oh. That's okay. Oh, Josh went first. That's yeah. right. He's so wide that he just couldn't get out of ruts. <laughs> I think I could have stayed more to the side. And I would have yeah. But I'll tell you what, this still isn't as steep as what we towed that Wildcat up at. Not at all. No, I, had, I had that bitch tow, tow rigged on the back of mine. Yep, after we got up on that high one. That's why I'm think. That's what I'm thinking. We could all. Well, I don't know how Josh would get up that. That rig's got to weigh 2,800 pounds. Yeah. <laughs> I got 18k. This ain't bad. You can at least walk it. Yeah. <laughs> so far I have just stay in this in this groove right here it, it's drier now stay to your left a little more left 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 yeah stay in that groove right there this is what's gonna suck right here this section It's gonna be a bitch going back up. We might have to walk up through the woods. I think Adrian can run it though. I think you can run that very easily. Up it? Yeah. What's the problem is all ice right here. Huh? Yeah, but you gotta stay if you can stay up on the wall. Yeah, once you get to that hump right there, it's easy. Yeah, that was his problem. He couldn't stay up on the wall. He yeah. just right back down. It's too muddy and slippery. But if he, even if he gets to there, we can winch from the rest of them the way up. the trail the other way? It's, 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 it's not, yeah. It's shitty. It's, it's all slick shit. We're not, you're going to be winching nonstop all the way up. You got right down this hill. You can back down. It's super easy. I think he can do it too. He filled the rope. So that's the only thing we can worry about is the rope. Yeah. And we're going to winch my we buddy. Got, we got all these people here, so we're just Hey, Adrian. Yeah. I'm not. Don't we? Take, don't take this the wrong way. Huh? Do you want me to back that down for you? What? I'm just thinking, where we're at right now, what's the chances of we just spinning you around? I tried. No, I'm, it's, fine. it's fine. It's fine. I'm definitely a little bit too... in over my pain right here. <laughs> no, you're fine. Yeah, but if he goes up a little bit more, right, and cuts real hard, I think we might be able to just spin him around. Option B. You both back down at the same time, strap his to the back of yours, tandem it. That way, his, he's not going to go head over. Use Josh's front tires. When Josh gets down, Adrian slowly goes. I'm gonna put a strap on the back of Josh. Yeah, that's what I just said. <laughs> and then, yeah. Well, I'm talking about your... hooking it to him, but yeah. if I feel if I if I back it up, I got a strap. That way, I got as much cable as possible to get was... me past that ledge. And then once I get past that ledge, and you just got me down, I'll just you know what I'm saying. I was. It's just that ledge, and I push on the back side of it. There's like three or four rocks in the log and shit. Like, <laughs> It's definitely a little bit better. I, I'm almost thinking we could probably might be able to get you to turn around. Oh my god, dude. If, if you pull forward a little bit and then back this way, you can turn. I would strap him. Then just back down. I'm just just back Josh's, down. Tire, Josh's tires are big enough to put his tires on this ledge, have Adrian go on top of his tires, and Josh slowly back out, and it slowly brings him down off the ledge. So Josh go first. Yeah. Backwards. Yeah, but then what am I going to hook to? No, just go. Get no, you, you, you go. had a game plan. Let's play right, game let's plan. Let's do it. You go down first. If you can get right here, we'll put your winch How line. How long on. is the strap? Long as huh? You gotta. Uh, Why can't we just use your winch line? Well, I don't know if I have enough winch line to get me past the. I could back down oh, a little. You'll more. have plenty okay. of winch. Hey, we can do this too. You back down that side. You broke both axles. Drops down on you. At the same time. If I grab you, I'm sorry. It's alright. This one's really. The front one's like twisted, and this one's like up at the. Outside. And you just put that one on up front. Right front. <laughs> No, it was that side. Left front? Yeah. <laughs> well, at least we know that one will come out. 
<laughs> That's good news, I'm trying to tell you. I might just call it quits and ride along. I only have one rear with me, so I'll need to buy another front. Hey, I'm just glad I didn't Dante this hill. <laughs> you were about to go up it? I was about to Dante it. Until I said it's a black, and then he said no. He went full Dante. You never go full Dante. <laughs> <laughs> This would have gave me issues because this is it's like making it. This is making it an adventure. Actually, I think I have a game plan for you, Adrian. We'll just take it slow, okay? All right. You're gonna go around the ledge? No, I think if he hugs. Well, it'll slide me over into the ledge. That was the problem. No, this is the thing. Where this bank is, he puts a tire on this bank going yep. backwards. He's only going to drop down a tiny bit on this side. Yeah. Yeah. He just goes straight back because he's then That's he's going to he pick came up. up through. Yeah, and he's going to pick up right on that. Middle Just keep your volume up loud on your radio so you can hear us. I'll say take the helmet off. But like... Nah, leave the helmet on. All right, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be semi behind you, beside you, okay? Yep. You still wanna pull the winch when you get down here? Yeah, I'm gonna turn it, just point it towards you. Okay. And then we'll get me hooked up for just a minute and get me past that ledge, and we'll unhook me and have him guide me by. Yep. Do you want a cigarette? I already smoked like three. Okay. <laughs> I know how you feel. I'm, I'm just, just trying to offer you one. <laughs> he said I know how you feel. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you ready? The, the wildcat that we pulled up at, at Windrock last year, it was steeper than this. Was it? They're light though. Nah. I... You on four wheel? Go forward and to the right a little more. Straighten your wheel up, straighten your wheel up. Here we go. Damn, that's a long ass whatever that is. Put that down. Keep going. You gotta let enough out to let yourself out. Keep going. Well, if you hook it, I'm just gonna go ahead and let it. I don't have enough. You, don't, you can't get to it. There we go. Oh, watch out, Gary. That ain't good. Hang on. You're gonna pull his machine down. My brakes are locked. Now he's gonna pull you down. Now we're taking you off. You're pulling him. I could push harder on the brakes, maybe. Just listen to him. He'll get you down. Yeah. Just listen to him. He'll get you down. Guide him. It's okay. Yo, watch me. It'll help you. Just a quick shout out to our sponsor, Evolution Power Sports in Reading, Pennsylvania. Your one-stop shop for pre-owned quality off-road vehicles and more. Stop by, give them a call, and let them know that the Beaten Trail sent you. Don't forget to visit our store for quality merchandise, hats and shirts, and so much more. All right, come straight. You're good. You're good. Keep going. Keep going slow. You're not going to go anywhere. You got three feet, two feet, one foot. All right. You're going to come up over a little lip, and your right side, your passenger side, is going to drop down about a foot.
Yep, just let it slide. You don't have to get there. You go. Now you're on ground. So your uh, driver's side is going to drop about eight inches, and you're going to kind of level out. Yep, and just keep your tires straight in the front. You're fine. There you go. All right. Now from there, turn your uh, front tires driver's side. That's fine. Yep, keep going that way. Keep going that way. All right, now straighten up. All right, now come back. There you go, you're sliding into the rut. That's where you want to be. All right, now keep on coming back. All right, you're going to come straight back. Keep going. All right, start turning a little bit driver's side. There you go, keep coming. All right, keep coming. Now go a little bit more driver's side for me. Keep coming. You're right. All right, driver's side's gonna drop down, I think, but you're, you're gonna be high on your right. You're good. Uh, yeah, you're straight. Keep coming. Keep coming. You're good, you're good. You're gonna drop down on driver's side a little bit, and then you're gonna start dro dropping down on passenger. Yep, you're good, you're good. Yep, just take it slow. Straighten out your front tires for me. There you go. All right, now we're in the rocky section. So I'm going to have you hug uh, the right side or your passenger side is how we're going to go down this. Um, so turn passenger side. All right, keep coming back slow. All right, keep coming, keep coming. Let me get down the rocks myself because I'm fat and greasy. All right, you're going to come, what you're going to do from here is you're going to come straight at me. So keep your tires straight and just go slow. Your right side's going to drop. There you go. Left side's going to drop. There you go. Now you're just going to ride two rocks about the same height. There you go. There you go. All right. There you go. Stay right there. All right, straighten your tires up a little bit. All right, you're good. You're good. All right, let me get down a little bit further for you. All right, yeah, you're gonna just stay straight. So, yep, back up, keep your front straight, and just go slow. I'm gonna come back in two, three minutes. Getting pretty low on down here. Good job, all right, yep, there you go. Now you're gonna climb a rock on your right side, just a little bit, small rock, there you go. All right, now, let me move a little bit more. You're making good progress. All right, so this is going to be probably the scariest part for you. It's not bad, but you'll be all right. Um, what I want you to do, uh, let me think about this for two seconds. I think he can just come right down this. So um, go passenger side with it a little bit. Uh, other way, other way, passenger. There you go, bud. All right, back up. All right, come straight back and straighten your front. There you go. Don't worry about sliding or anything. You're not going to go anywhere, okay? Okay, so from here, you're going to drop about 10 inches on your right side. You're fine. Just go slow. There you go. Uh, you're going to drop on your left side now. There you go. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, keep it forward just a tiny bit. You only got to go an inch. You just ran over your strap. There you go. All right, hold on. Okay, uh, come back slow. You're going to drop another eight inches on your right side. There you go. Now you're level. Feeling good. All right, keep coming. All right, from here, um, I think what I want you to do with this is turn passenger a little bit. Yep, and keep backing up. You don't want to go too far. You're good. You're just dropping a few inches. Keep coming. 
All right, straighten it out a little bit. You might want to turn driver now. You're fine. You're bottomed out on a rock, so you're not going anywhere. So keep on coming. There you go. All right. Uh, you're actually, after this, you're out of it, buddy. You're good to go. Straight back. Uh, turn driver with it so you avoid the log, and then you can pop a U and get out of here. Uh, I'd straighten up a little bit. Yep. Just slow. Keep it straight. Your driver's side's going to start to drop down here. Keep it slow. Yep, keep your wheel straight. Yep, now you're down to the big part. Hold on, stay there so I can go. I don't know how the hell we're going to get back up this. <laughs> All right. James, drop it. Your passenger side is going to drop down a little bit. It's riding up the wall. T turn passenger. Nope, the other way. There you go. Turn driver. That's it. That's it. Straighten up. I'm I'm putting you right in his same tracks. Keep coming straight. Uh, turn. No, 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 no. Straighten up. No, 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 no. Yeah, there you go. Um, you're gonna have to pull forward a little because you're gonna ride up the wall up on that side. You gotta go. Josh, Josh, Josh. You gotta get this wheel up here. You can't turn, you gotta turn. Turn that way. I can't go forward. At all? No, you only got two wheels. Yeah. And no winch. Um, I don't think this is going to be good. Hold on, hold on. Slippery. Uh, yeah. I don't know how well this is going to work here.
Beaten Trail team will return with more Tennessee videos. All right, we'll be up in about five minutes. We're turning around and we're coming back out where you all are sitting. Copy.